Hello PlayZoo friends, my name is Jenny. Thanks for joining us for the Hamill Family PlayZoo video series, bringing the PlayZoo to you. Today, we will use our creativity and our fingers to create a finger painting inspired by an amazing animal, the taper. Let's go. Here at Brookfield Zoo, Sunny and Sorghum live in the pachyderm house. They are two terrific tapers. Wild tapers live in the forests and wetlands of Asia and Central and South America. Tapers have a very unique nose. It is long and strong. The taper's nose is prehensile, which means they can use it to grab and hold things. Tapers use their prehensile nose to grab leaves and fruit and to pull them off of branches or pick them up off the ground. They can use their prehensile nose to hold onto their food and put it into their mouths. Just as a taper uses its prehensile nose to grab and hold its food, we use our fingers to grab and hold things. <laughs> Let's create a work of art inspired by the taper. Instead of using crayons or paint brushes, we can use our fingers. First, let's make the finger paint. We can mix one cup of flour and one cup of water together. Or if you have paint at home, you can use that too. Then we can add our paint mixture into small bowls so that we can create the colors that we want by adding food coloring. <laughs> it helps to have a wet towel handy when you get ready to finger paint and to use cardboard or heavy paper to paint on. Now, let's paint. The taper's amazing prehensile nose is inspiring. Let's use our prehensile fingers to create a taper-inspired painting. We can grab and hold different objects to paint with. Let's try painting with a stick. We can use our fingers to grab and hold the stick, just like a taper can use its nose to grab and hold things. Hmm, let's try painting with a spoon. <laughs> our prehensile fingers can grab and hold lots of different objects that we can use for painting. We can also use our fingers for painting. We can move and curl our fingers just like a taper can move and curl its trunk. Let's explore how we can use our fingers to move the paint around on the paper. We can use our fingers to create lines and shapes. We can use one finger at a time or all of our fingers at once. We can even use our fingers to paint our hand and make a handprint on our paper or we can pour our paint onto a plate or a tray and press our hand into the paint. Hmm, I wonder if I can turn my handprint into a taper. Hmm. That was fun. Finger painting is a fun way to create unique works of art using our prehensile fingers. Hmm, there's another part of our body that we can use to grab and hold things, our toes. I wonder what it would be like to make paintings with our toes. You can send pictures of your artwork to the address on your screen. See you next time. <laughs>